Sergeant Steele, formerly Austria's number one hard rock band, is facing a major crisis. At their headquarters, the boys are having to face the facts. Their career is stagnating and they're running out of money. The once glorious music scene is changing. The, the whole rock and roll shit is it's bullshit. You know, a few years ago, uh, we played huge venues and we sold uh, lots of records. Nowadays, rock and roll is dead. We're, we're totally out of money. I have had to get myself uh, a second job, you know? Real work. I'm exhausted. I'm not made for work. 20 years of rock and roll, I've never had to spend my money for sex. And now I have to give my last time for some pornographic magazines. A world without Sergeant Steel, the band is looking into the abyss. The band has to get its success story back on track. The boys are working feverishly on a solution. Sergeant Steel begins desperately searching for options. I'm really well known in the music scene as a jazz fan. I'm absolutely uh, into, into rock music. I can't even hear the differences, you know, rock, hip hop, jazz. I always wanted to co combine uh, the world music thing and such a steel. All I can think about is cash flowing. The band seems burned out and frustrated in view of the hopeless situation. Until Phil, in his delirious state, comes up with a brilliant idea. We gonna, we we just do that thing, yeah, and we we gonna we rap and we dance and that's that's our way. So we're gonna conquer the world. It's no matter if we do rock and roll or hip hop. We just gonna conquer the world. The decision has been made. It's time to celebrate. Sergeant Steel goes hip hop. We have to do some hip hop to refill. I was really uh, astonished by, um, you know, I asked them to do rock, but they definitely wanted to do a hip hop record. And, you know, so the customer is king, so that's what we ended up doing. trusting me because you know I, I'm the boss I'm chief of such and steel and everything I want to do they, they do it for me <laughs> 